So I made a base and then attached that generator to it. Uh, so now the fuel tank and the generator are out of the bus, but they're here as a like an APU that I can use here on the property if I need to, but it's not going with us on the bus. So I'll have it covered up out here with a tarp. Um, maybe eventually I'll build a little roof for it or something or a little shed for it. But it just gives us some power out here, but it is securely mounted. It's attached. I got rubber isolator underneath of it. Um, the exhaust is on there, so it runs nice and quiet. So anyways, yeah, we have this whole little extra power unit out here that we can use to if we need to charge the bus. We had a really bad day yesterday. It stormed really bad all day long. We only had 900, 940 watt hours was our solar all day. 920 watt hours had been our previous low for a day. Uh, we averaged close to five kilowatt hours. So not even one kilowatt. Uh, but by like 10.30 this morning, it was cloudy, but we had already produced more power than we had all day yesterday. The sun's actually coming in and out of the clouds now, and we're looking real good. I, I, uh, we had got down to 29% last night. Kelly did a lot of baking and cooking yesterday. Um, so that was no no big issue though. So it's up over 50% uh, by like one o'clock. Uh, I haven't checked it in a while, but uh, yeah, we'll be getting close to 100 today. But once we double our solar output, I won't even really have to worry about cloudy days like that. We'll be s sitting pretty. There it is, covered up with the tarp for now. Everything's looking good. Got 35 gallons of fresh drinking water in the back of the thing that we're going to go transfer over to the bus today. In my little pickup truck. One of our YouTube viewers sent me this, uh, Pat Gould sent me this 3D printed uh, walk the plank mousetrap. Um, I need to change the board that I've got here in just a second. That's the board that I had for my other one. But yeah, they just walk up it and then once they start going for it, it's got a magnet on it and they fall down and then it resets. It's got a little magnet that holds it. It's got a little bit of tension, but just the slightest amount of weight will flip it back like that. So we got some peanut butter on it coming up the thing. Hopefully we'll catch some mice in that bucket, uh, but we'll see. But I need to change the board. Uh, that was just the one that I had from the other one. Um, but yeah, if I get them a board, uh, I'm going to take this one over here and it can go right in here. Just give them a nice little ramp to get right up to it. Probably didn't need all this extra peanut butter on it, but I had it, so I wanted to give them something to get them up here. We'll see how it goes. I think I'm going to put a couple sunflower seeds in the end if I get them to. That is a big spider. Um... I'm gonna say four inches from the front foot to the back foot. <laughs> Kelly just moved a box. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious! <laughs> oh yeah, real funny. <laughs> Damn, that little thing's fast. I'm not going back by him. <laughs> Why you gotta run towards me? <laughs>